Yo my people, what's good? It's Boz Brazy here. So the new Outbreak trailer is finally out. Come on man, we've been waiting for this for so long now. So yeah my people, at the end of this as well, I'm going to be looking through the COD blog post just to see what type of new things are coming out. Any new guns. Me personally, I'm a massive Zombies fan. Trying to see if there's any new perks, anything like that, you know. Like I've been messing with Tombstone as a perk. But at the same time, it has been messing me up way too many times, man. But yeah, let's get into it, my people. Oh, what? Snitch, the rats are here. And so it begins. Hold on, Rebus. We are inbound. I have you, Beasle. LC is hot. Copy that. It's go time. Looks so nice. No. <laughs> no Get to the specimen analyzer and investigate. Hold them off. We can't risk losing this data. Strike team, get that rover to the breach point. That's my chance. Eat six. <laughs> no. I'm sweating when I tell you yeah this trailer looks beautiful oh my days and I love the way they were mixing Warzone with zombies man I haven't really touched Warzone in a while just because well when you see the way these hackers be killing me yeah I heard COD's been doing something about these hackers so I might finally get back into it but zombies though are messing with it heavy man You could play with the squad or you can just play on your own But yeah there's a couple things I'm extremely excited about so Let's get into it That whole scene yeah So crazy the cinematics Cod such a visually pleasing game you know I think gameplay wise I've had a lot of issues personally like I'm on the PS4 so yeah you see the whole zombies but with vehicles i think that's such a good idea can't lie this is gonna be so fun with this squad man i hope all the guys be down so this right here i think this is like you see with zombies different tasks like i don't really mind them like it's definitely fun objectives but not as long as it's not too crazy you know right that dragon looks so dope That transition man from multiplayer to zombies was wild. They haven't really showed us the wonder weapon yet, but so far I'll be messing with it. I can't lie for the 5 AZ though. It's a little different, you know, because obviously you can absorb the zombies. This stuff looks heat. And I ain't just saying it because it's fire there. Bruh, a whole armor man. 
the way Warzone is going to be like the next year or so is going to be mad. Warzone has so much potential. This trailer right here, there is a one. But yeah, my people, so I'm just legit on the Call of Duty website, just reading through the blog. COD has recently been dropping a lot of free content, you know. Ooh, so you get six free guns, four new maps. Outbreak, four new operators, man. So I, I barely use them operators, you know. I lie, man. You see these, lot, yeah, I'm messing with them heavy. It's so nice to outfit. Six new weapons, this is what I'm talking about, man. The Far 83 Assault Rifle. Okay, so this is meant to have the fastest fire rate. A new submachine gun, a well rounded full automatic submachine gun. The LC10 Grant CQB operator's ability to stretch fights out into mid range on a smaller, although his damage per shot is on the lower end of the SMG spectrum. It's above average fire rate and lower recoil. Okay. I think this is them guns that you see the Milano right now with this crazy fire rate. I think it's going to be something like that with this very good range, you know. Machete. Yeah, I can't lie. The way people on Cold War. Wow, this looks nice. A new sniper. The ZRG20 no. As well as its ability to eliminate operators with a single shot to the head, chest or shoulders. I actually hope a single shot though. Like the Pellington. The more hit markers I'm getting with it is disgusting. And I maxed out the gun as well. So the way to get them are complete a related challenge to obtain the free base weapons or purchase a bundle with blueprint versions when it appears in the store. Call I fair enough. Zombies expands in outbreak. This is what I'm talking about. New zombies experience outbreak. Space throughout the Euro Mountain. Tracking with new enemies. Whether it's hunting down elite enemies using a satellite tracker, escorting a rover that detects dimensional portals or holding out against zombies in a confined dark eater zone. Oh my days, a new field upgrade, Frenzied Guard, I think I'm saying it right, I ain't gonna lie, like I've been just sticking to healing aura really, it just does me well you know, and like I just love how it pushes enemies away, as well as Ring of Fire, Ring of Fire is nice whenever I'm playing solos, but for zombies man there's always somebody that gets caught in. Upon activation all enemies will immediately target their frenzied guard user for a brief period during which time only armor will take damage this can be a game changer when follow operatives are surrounded by the undead masses turn the attention away from those in peril and towards the armored savior this sounds mad still like i said the main reason i've been messing with the healing aura is due to the fact that if anyone's cornered it's, it's an easy escape for them but this also helps but at the same time, like, healing aura can also, like, revive teammates. Well, this is more just, like, it helps them out death feel, right? And only losing armor, they're so calm. A new ammo mod, Shatter Blast, ready to bring the boom. The Pack-a-Punch machine and Elemental Pop will now include the Shatter Blast ammo mod, which makes all bullets deal explosive damage, bar. Explosive damage, I found out is the one. Like, I used to use the stun one. You shoot an enemy and they're still just chilling there. And I've died way too many times to it, man. I learned my lesson. Explosive damage just helps out so much. Each bullet has a chance to explode, dealing additional explosive damage and destroying all impacted armor. Armored, these armored zombies be wild, man intended to help destroy heavy zombies this fantastic mod comes with plenty of explosive upgrades through the skill menu including having all explosive deal double damage to nearby zombies knock down normal enemies or double the size for an even bigger bang two new skills tier so yeah my people comment down below what your highest wave is with your mates and what your solo highest wave is as well Eclipse is 6v6 map. Seems like it's a small map as well, which I'm messing with. Like, I miss the small maps on Modern Warfare, you know. 
but it's just easy to upgrade guns because one thing I noticed is it takes so long to upgrade guns in this game by the time I'm finally done like I'm so tired of using it I'm trying to test out a new gun Mansion 2v2 3v3 What's everyone's opinion on face off as well man? Miami Strike 6v6 A gun game is the one If you're ever trying to like improve your accuracy but also like just, just improve yourself as a player Because here you're running through your predetermined set of 20 weapons Starting with a pistol and ending with an axe. So you're just making your way up Usually it'll be like near the end it'll be like a launcher and then a knife I believe and it's like but if somebody stabs you though you go down a rank dot pal 6v6 one of the new score streaks is the death machine which was first seen in black ops 1 Ooh, they're adding it to zombies as well dropping in the vehicles man so they're having a light truck as well which we did see in the trailer yeah my people so I hope you all enjoyed the whole video if you stuck to the end I appreciate it so much but yeah, so I can't wait. This is going to be wild. Zombies is going to be so much more fun, right? But yeah, make sure you all give this video a like. If you want more videos Call of Duty related, just comment down below. So yeah, let's get it, my people. Thank you so much. Make sure you all like and subscribe. Appreciate you.